look so pregnant. I am currently 34 weeks. Um, 34 weeks yesterday. I had a doctor's appointment today. The doctor... Let's not talk about the doctor's appointment today. I want to talk about the flower essences that I have got for pregnancy, birth, well let's, let's say I've got some flower essences for pregnancy, labor, birth, and motherhood. So um, if you don't know what flower essences are, they are um, a healing modality started by Edward Bach way back in the day um i don't want to say any dates off the top of my head but um yeah so for me flower essences work a lot like crystals um very subtle they work on the energetic body and the first flower essences that i ever purchased were um impatience flower essence and honeysuckle flower essence so I got impatience um, for my first flower essence because I am a very impatient person. And so um, so what it does is that the flower has the personality of the person that's using it, right? And they come in these. This is Arnica right here. Um, but yeah. Um, I'm probably explaining how flower essences work really badly, but for those who know how they work, y'all know how it goes. Let me go ahead and show you the flower essences that I got for pregnancy, childbirth, and motherhood. <laughs> okay, um, this is white chestnut. The lighting is really bad. I have my ring light on. I showed you Arnica. I got Serato. I got Mamulus. Elm. And Walnut. So I am currently using White Chestnut and Elm together because um, I recently um, ordered all of these and so elm and white chestnut are what I started with and um, so I got elm basically because I know that becoming a mother I'm going to have a lot of responsibilities and I tend to procrastinate and stuff like that so I got elm for that and just um, just embodying being responsible um, and um, just being able to shoulder tasks effectively and not being overwhelmed by the things that I need to do because I have a tendency to do that. So that's what Elm is for. And then I'm using White Chestnut to um, help with my chatter box mind. I have a tendency for my mind to run and run and run and run and run. And um, I, I'm really enjoying the combination so far. I think um, because I am in the third trimester and I need more rest, uh, white chestnut is making me sleepy. If you use flower essences and um, white chestnut makes you sleepy, please let me know because I really do feel like... Um, because, yeah, I wasn't even going to make this video. I was going to take a nap. But um, I was thinking that the reason why I've, I feel like I need to take a nap is because I'm probably, I probably just need to rest right now. My body is just doing a lot. Um, but I, I really like white chestnut um, for tranquility. Um, it, what I noticed that it does for me is that it, um, allows me to listen to music sometimes like my mind will be so chattery that I won't even make room for the things that I like to do and I love listening to music so um 
I noticed when, when I take white chestnut, it helps me put on some music and it helps me to sing. Um, because when you're singing, your mind is in a very light state. Your mind is in a very, um, I like to say angelic, is in a very calm state. So white chestnut really helps me with that. So I'm really loving that combination. I'm really glad I got that. Um, next, I am, ooh, my back hurts. Okay. Next, I am using Serato and Walnut. Yes. Because um, at 34 weeks, I am developing my birth plan. And um, so far, I plan on having a hospital birth, but I know that with hospital policies and what normally goes on in hospitals and stuff like that, I am going to be met with a lot of resistance. So, I got Serato to just so I can really trust my inner knowing my intuition, my inner being, and be able to stand up for myself. Same thing with Walnut. Walnut is good for um, establishing your own values and living in your own truth and stuff like that, which is also going to be very important for me as a mother because, you know, left and right people are telling me, you know, oh, my childbirth went like this, oh, right, I raised my kid this way and stuff like that. So. A lot of people are going to be helping me, but I just want to be able to tune into that part of my brain, that part of my intuition that is going to allow me to follow what I feel is right. Um, Walnut is good if you have a tendency to overly take advice from other people, which is me. Um, so I started taking this combination yesterday last night actually because I had a doctor's appointment today and um, I took it last night because I felt like I needed some extra push and I felt like I needed some extra bravery to literally tell my doctor what I want from my birth plan because my birth plan is not traditional from uh, what most hospitals and what most doctors do so um, yeah I am going to continue to take that um, and yeah I'm just going to um, update uh, the other two flower essences I'm just going to like just slowly introduce them to um, just introduce them to my energetic field and stuff like that I just don't want to like I like to I like to gradually use them and see what works and then see how it works too because I like to see how it is uh, working in my life. What I like about flower essences is that like I said they're a lot like crystals so you um, once you use them you will be given experiences um, to match the results that you're trying to get um, just like for example if you grab a rose quartz like or I'm pretty sure you've like had a crystal and you feel like things start to happen or whatever um, and that's why some people are very careful with the crystals that they use because sometimes they feel like um, bad things happen it's not that bad things are happening it's just um, a reaction of your energy with the crystal and stuff like that so flower essences work the same way and um yeah so that's why i am taking my time with each of them um just to go into it like the arnica is i'm pretty sure i'm gonna need the arnica for labor because arnica is good for tra uh, trauma and emergency situations and not saying that I expect labor to be um, a traumatic situation but 
I want to be fully present for everything that's happening. And um, Arnica is um, a good flower essence to help you stay in your body. So I'm just looking forward to just using all of these. I hope a lot of what I said makes sense. I'm just making this video on the fly. But yeah, um, you can Google flower essences so you can get an idea of what exactly they are um, and how they're used. Um, I, like I said, I'm not, I don't think I would explain it as well as I would like to. But yeah, I love flower essences. Like, um, they have been a great healing modality for me. And um, I just can't wait to um, continue to use them and um, not only for myself but for other women because I am starting my postpartum doula training as well. And that is something that I cannot wait to share with other women because of I know how flower essences helped me. So I can't wait to share it with other women. And I'm going to show my belly. This is me at 34 weeks. <sighs> yes. And I want to show off my beautiful flowers as well. I got some tulips and hyacinth and carnations but yep those are my flower essences and that's what i'm up to right now